Well, tonight we're talking about what police officers can legally do while they're on duty and again what your rights are. So if you have a question, call us. There's the number on your screen. We've got Kayla up next in Birmingham tonight. So hey, Kayla, how are you doing? Good. How are you? Good. Thank you. Tell us uh, what, what's on your mind tonight. Um, I just had a question. Um, a while back, my husband was arrested. Now, when they arrested him, he got down on the ground. He surrendered. They put their foot in his back and they pulled his arm up and basically they broke his shoulder. Okay. They, um, and after that, they took him straight to jail and he didn't go to the hospital till the next day. Now, with him surrendering, I was wondering, is there someone, is there something that he should have done or is there something that he could do or there was somebody we could talk to? Okay, good question. Well, my, my response would first be it depends on what occurred but prior to you know him surrendering. If it was a, an incident where uh, the officer had been on a long chase with your, <coughs> I don't know if you said it was your husband or, or whoever it was, um, but it sounds to me like if he's clearly given up and is laying down on the ground, then you at, or he, the officer at that point, doesn't need to use that much force, especially mm -hmm. something that would break your, your shoulder. Uh, of course, there would be a dispute about that, I'm sure, but um, normally it, it just comes in down to a question of what is a reasonable amount of force to use in that situation, and uh, it's kind of fact-specific, but I, I think you should talk to somebody and to have that investigated further. How much time does someone like Kayla have, to, or I guess her boyfriend or husband, how, how much time do they have to file a claim based on this particular area of law? Okay, uh, that's a good question. It depends. If you're filing a state law claim against an officer mm -hmm. or against uh, a deputy, uh, the city officer, you have to file a notice of claim in six months. Uh, a deputy who works for the county, you'd have to file it within a year. But your federal claims against any of those people would need to be filed within two years. And those claims against the city and against the county, six months and a year, the notice of claim, uh, if they're minors, it also has to be filed within that six month, doesn't it? I think that's correct, yes. Yeah, so I guess the point is if uh, folks can't wait around just because uh, they might think that because they're a minor they have extra time, I understand that they don't under today's law. That's right. Yeah.